और कार्डियक अरेस्ट एंड हार्ट अटैक सेम थिंग ए हार्ट अटैक इन्वॉल्व्स एन इंटरप्शन इन द ब्लड सप्लाई टू द हार्ट ए कार्डियक अरेस्ट इज व्हेन द हार्ट स्टॉप्स पंपिंग ब्लड अराउंड द बॉडी ए हार्ट अटैक कैन लीड टू ए कार्डियक अरेस्ट द अमेरिकन हार्ट एसोसिएशन डिस्क्राइब्स द डिफरेंस बिटवीन ए हार्ट अटैक एंड ए कार्डियक अरेस्ट एज ए सर्कुलेशन इशू compared with an electrical problem with a heart attack a blocked artery prevents blood flow to the part of the heart that the artery serves this causes that part of the heart to begin to die with a cardiac arrest the heart has an electrical malfunction and stops beating suddenly this video explains the difference between a heart attack and a cardiac arrest and heart failure what is a cardiac arrest a cardiac arrest happens suddenly usually without warning when the heart stops pumping blood around the body a person can fall unconscious and die within minutes if they do not receive immediate treatment Many cardiac arrest occur because a person has had a heart attack which causes an abnormal heart rhythm known as arrhythmia a common cause of cardiac arrest is an arrhythmia called ventricular fibrillation ventricular fibrillation happens when the heart's electrical circuitry becomes chaotic instead of beating the heart fibrillates meaning that it quivers symptoms of a cardiac arrest in most cases the first symptom of a cardiac arrest is loss of consciousness sometimes a person experiences warning signs of a cardiac arrest within the hour before the cardiac arrest warning signs include racing heartbeat light headedness or dizziness chest pain shortness of breath nausea vomiting if someone has already had a cardiac arrest they may be not breathing or breathing abnormally making gasping gasping sounds unconscious unresponsive if a, if a by stander tries to find a pulse they will not be able to locate one cardiac arrest what to do in an emergency cardiac arrest is an emergency and witnesses should take immediate action if more than one person is available one should begin cardiopulmonary resuscitation or cpr while the other calls for emergency services and looks for an automated external defibrillator automated external defibrillators are programmed to give an electric shock to the heart if they detect a dangerous heart rhythm such as ventricular fibrillation it is often possible to find an automated external defibrillator mounted on the exterior of prominent public buildings or inside buildings such as shopping malls schools hotels and grocery stores defibrillation with an automated external defibrillator must happen within seconds to minutes of a person having a cardiac arrest as their chance of surviving decreases rapidly with time what is a heart attack in the united states someone has a heart attack every 40 seconds a heart attack happens when there is an interruption in the blood supply to, to the heart This usually happens when a blood clot blocks one of the coronary arteries. The heart still pumps blood around the body, but the part of the heart that usually receives blood from the blocked artery begins to die.
A heart attack can cause serious damage to the heart and be fatal. The most common cause of heart attack is coronary artery disease in which the artery walls become clogged with atheroma. A buildup of fatty deposits. If a place of atheroma breaks off, a clot forms around it which can block the blood flow. Symptoms of a heart attack. Although the symptoms of a heart attack can appear suddenly, this is not always the case. Some people's symptoms are mild and gradual, developing over days to weeks. The symptoms can differ between the sexes and even among heart attacks in the same person. However, Typical symptoms of a heart attack include chest pain or discomfort, heavy or burning pain that spreads to one or both arms or the back, neck, jaw or stomach, shortness of breath, lightheadedness, nausea, a rapid or irregular heartbeat, sweating. Some people may experience a silent heart attack, which is one that happens either without symptoms or with very mild symptoms. According to one estimate, silent heart attacks account for almost 50% of heart attacks. Being older and having conditions that cause nerve damage such as diabetes can affect how a person experiences pain. As a result, a person may have a heart attack without feeling pain. Heart attack. What to do in an emergency? If a person thinks that they or the person they are with is having a heart attack, they should maximize the chance of a good outcome by calling for emergency services immediately, sitting down and staying calm. Chewing and swallowing 325 milligrams of aspirin if possible. Waiting for the emergency medical services. The American Heart Association suggests calling an ambulance rather than going by car to the emergency room. As emergency medical services staff can begin treatment as soon as they reach the person. Individuals arriving at the emergency room by ambulance will therefore usually receive treatment sooner than those arriving by car. The quicker a person receives treatment, the better their outlook. What is heart failure? A person with heart failure has a weakened heart that cannot pump blood around the body properly. The heart can sustain damage during a heart attack or as a result of high blood pressure. The symptoms of heart, heart failure include shortness of breath, fatigue, swelling in the ankles and feet, blotting, exercise intolerance, shortness of breath when lying down. With the right medication and lifestyle changes, a person with heart failure can live a normal, active life.